On this winter solstice, tonight is often referred to as the longest night of the year, and it's no coincidence the Salvation Army uses this night to call attention to the many homeless people in the area who have died in 2016. ABC 7's Ray Collins joins us live from a memorial vigil at the Salvation Army's Center of Hope on 10th Street in Sarasota. Ray. Scott, yes, indeed, a grim event, an annual event here at the facility every year on 10th between Orange and Central in Sarasota. We've got some video for you from last year's event, a very similar feeling when I was here exactly a year ago tonight. The vigil starts, as you hear, with bagpipes and ends with taps. And along the way, a candle is lit, and the names of the homeless who died this year are read out loud. The number is being used this year. 57 have passed away this year. That's 32 in Sarasota and 25 in Manatee County. Many of them, a great many of them, are drug overdose victims. I'm going to talk right now to Chris Johnson from Salvation Army. And Chris, step right in here. Tell us why it's important to have this event tonight. It's important because as a community, we need to come together and realize the impact that drug addiction, that homelessness has on every single one of us. It allows us an opportunity to come together to remember and then also to remember why we do what we do every single day as we reach out. And truly a great many of these are drug victims. They absolutely are. The vast majority of them are. Okay, you're doing great work. Thanks for your time tonight. Chris Johnson of the Sarasota Salvation Army. Again, a vigil is just getting started as we speak to honor the 52 homeless people who have passed away this year on the Sun Coast. More at 11 for now. I'm Ray Collins. Scott, back to you in the studio. All right, Ray, thank you.